Miley Cyrus poses for Marc Jacobs. Miley is indeed the newest face of Marc Jacobs. She will be representing the brand's spring-summer 2014 campaign. The first set of photos are officially out, and in the first one we see a close-up shot of Miley on a sandy yet dark beach rocking a pair of sunglasses while a red-headed model lays down looking pretty lifeless behind her. In the next shot, Miley poses in a pair of burgundy shorts and a navy military style jacket with black embellishments. Our girl looks pretty pensive and almost sad in this photo. And again, we have the lifeless redheaded line next to her while a kind of zombie looking blonde stands in the background. Interesting. This news shouldn't be too surprising. MySci recently posed for the Marc Jacobs Protect the Skin You're In t-shirt campaign. You know, the one where Miley poses nude on a t-shirt. And earlier this week, she uploaded a pic of herself to Twitter wearing a different tee by Marc Jacobs, which simply read, I pay my taxes, I want my rights. Mark is thrilled to have Miley on board. In a statement, he said, quote, We all just love her and her entire being, her energy, her talent, her intelligence, everything. There is nothing I don't like about her. She is just genuine and very natural. Not everyone is as happy, though. The photographer that he usually works with did not want to be involved with Miley's campaign. Instead, David Sims shot the photos because Mark's usual photographer, quote, just did not want to shoot her. Okay, then. Now, I have to change the subject real fast. Nina Dobrev and Ian Summerhalder shared the cutest and most awkward moment on stage at the People's Choice Awards last night. If you missed it, we have a clip for you. Just click the box, right? Here, yeah, it's right there. And before you go, what do you think of Miley's Marc Jacobs photos? Do you love them or do you hate them? Vote below or you can tweet me and then keep those star of the week votes coming in over on DHR. In Hollywood, I'm your host Katie Krause and I'll see you back here on Clever News next time.